Hello and welcome back. Right, let's first of all, my very first job is let's just see if the Zeta is working as straight away or whether it's not. Oh, it's filling again. Right, okay, well that's that's the start because it wasn't doing that at all. It is moving slightly, ever so slightly. Right, I'm going to literally drop the back off. Gonna just try to move that. I I'm not sure whether it's more over to the left as you look at it here, or the right as if you was the other way around. If that makes any sense at all. Yeah, I thought let's get these little silly jobs out of the way, and we really do need to get the this dumped right. Actually, though, yeah. Just the one thing I am very sorry for is I may I was that busy doing this that and the other that I didn't the one thing I said was oh let's go and have a look I'm sure you're all wanting to see how much barley we did in the end did I did I show you the barley no I didn't so let's remedy that before we do anything else let's have a look how well did we do no we didn't stick any in to make flour did we I don't think let's have a quick look yeah I was <laughs> 110,000 I've still 170 tons of sugar beet. Let's just check productions in case. I can't recall, but I may have done. I know what I'm like. Have we got any barley? In? No, we didn't. Right, so it was indeed. That is everything. 110 tons of barley. That is not bad. No, that's not bad at all. Right, I'm with, I think it's over the other side. I can see this time. I can actually do this without. Bashing into anything. I think it's a bit further over that side. There's that white dot that we put in. Is that where it needs to be? Yes! Right, okay. And we can still feel from here. So let's put the little Zeta back on. And let's grab that back. And yeah, so it was partially placement. So that is much better though. That is a much, much better location than it was before. But it, it had crashed and burned as well, because it wouldn't even fill, and it said fill, so that I wasn't making it up. It, but I was in the wrong place as well, so I was doubly right. Yes, I was right. Yeah, I'm back on greeners because I am doing what I said. I don't mean I'm not going to do anything else, but I thought, yeah, I would like to. Uh, it, it's it's the end of an era. It is, and I may do a, a one episode of each of my other Let's Plays, uh, Rumboz, because the Rumboz had the entire weekend last weekend, so yeah, I might well do one episode of Rumboz, 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 and one episode of Stone Valley, just to keep things ticking over, and do the same to Hobo's Hollow, because that likewise is in the last year, I think, I think, no, I'm not sure, no, we'll, yeah, I'm going to go on Hobo's Hollow and we're going to see what needs doing and if it is the same screenings then why is that not popping? Am I not quite quite the right place? So it looks right to me. Very much so. Right, yes that is such a absolutely boy does that grab some water this. Yeah it is I, I do think I'm right. In, or the what does it say water? Eight hundred and fifty three tons does grab almost everything so it is it's one of those where if I was to stick to one the water distributor would be four million tons so you'd be forever filling it all it would be nice to see a water system where you can literally it itself fills I don't know whether these um, giants have been dead set against something like that, but there's never been anything as far as I'm aware like that so but that would be really useful. Water storage, because let's be honest, it is it's certainly is realistic. I remember as a kid in Britain, I mean, it's something that they got rid of uh, as farmers always. Oh, wow, there's not much gone down in that, actually. Oh, did I? Ah, I might have topped up. Yeah, I probably did. Yeah. Right, so we need to be getting on with our harvest. Right, so we've bought our new header. Finally, now that's a point. Actually, all of the work is across the road. Let's drop you down. Grab you. Finally. 
Don't ask me why, although I do think it looks very nice. Red and green together. Or well, It's funny, because when I was a kid, you know, people said red and green were horrible together. But I actually quite like it. Again, I suppose it depends on the red and the green. But I think that looks really nice. Don't ask me why I didn't get a John Deere header, though. Because I have no idea why I got a case stuck in my head. When it was fairly obvious I've got a John Deere harvester. And at no point did I ever forget that. So... Yeah, there are a few little bits and bobs. The biggest bit is that bit over there. We shall see if it bugs me. If it does, I shall. Yeah. I'm going to stick this here for now. We're going to go across the road. That is the point. We're going to go out those other gates. There's no way I'm going to scrunch those tyres through that because it just about squeezes through. Right, we're going to need this again. Let's get this. And I think the Adjurante is big. Yeah, I think that's not a bad idea. Right, okay. Smashing. Let's get this on follow. The grass is ready, and I do think I'm right, because there's no rush for the mowing. There's no, we're not going to get two cuts in. It would... Wait, <laughs> July, August, September, October. You could just about, but I never cut in November, although I know this would be the last one ever, ever. So... It's not right. Why is that not? Well, it is. But we're going to be busy. But yeah, I'm going to do the one last cut. I'm going to stick some guns on that. Because, yeah, I know technically you could say, oh, well, it's not quite. Yeah, you could say that, but, do you know, I think we're doing well enough. It's not... Yeah, with all the straw, I was going to say that I did have a point. I think there's going to be a lot of stuff that isn't done. It's just not going to get uh, processed. So if I stick another 800 tons of grass in, that's not going to get processed. Then what's the point? Yeah, it just there is no point. Right, that's now that is getting. Way a lot now. This might be able to manage that because it's definitely, yeah. Let's stick that. Let's see if we can get that in a little bit there. Not like the big John Deere, which is way too big. I remember it's following, or it should be. Excellent. Oh wow, she didn't even, that was fantastic. Right, now then. Now, it's time to drop the headers off and drop them over. It is. Let's make it easy for... Yeah, I wish this, I wish you could oh, change your zoom to about that level. Although I'd say that and then there'd probably be something or the reason why not. So let's drop that there. Get out of the way and let the wheel loader drop that one in. While that's doing that, let's grab the other one and start your engine. Sounds like a pole position. Start your engines. Yes. Yes, it is. I am sad. I am as well. I don't want anybody to think that uh, this is uh, Peter 978 has done such a job. I, it, 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 I, I did fall in love with it right in the beginning, but I've got to be honest, yeah, I it sort of fell in love with the Let's Play a lot. It, it, and that grew... Oh, it's not liking that. No, let's try that again. Let's see if we can get in a slightly different place where it's not upset. We don't want any... We don't want any catapulting happening today. No. Ooh, like that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Now, it did this perfectly well the other day. Oh, it's do oh, it's crashed. See that when the head goes funny on that? Yeah, it's clicking. I may have to come out of the get. Yeah, I've seen that before. It's crashed and burned. Yeah, it's... 
Well, I didn't expect that. Right, I should be back shortly. And I will probably have to come completely out of the game. Because I've been here before. So see you shortly. Hello. Right, yeah, sorted. Actually, some of it I think was position that I'd got. I don't, it did, I'd reset it. Oh, that reminds me. Let me just quickly reset that back to where it should be. Yeah. Because I've, I've still, ooh, still wobbling. To make this snappy, I think. It's not liking that at all. That was better than the, the air earlier, definitely. Ooh, the head is still wobbling, but right. Let's set that going. I've started another load of the. Oh, that, yeah, that reminds me. I need to start engines because these do take a while. Yeah. All right, smash. It. Let's get you started. And fuel, we will make it, but yes, we are not looked after these very well. Right, smashing, come on. Ooh. Right, yeah, I do still realise one of these headers is not actually the Dominator header, but it is a nice, small, class one, so. This is field 54, 54, 5.1 metre, header 2, clear, load, activate. You can be left, and I think I need to shut the gate, or else we're going to have trouble. Oh, actually, no, I don't think we are. I changed that, didn't I? But it might still get it. Yeah, I did that slightly different course, didn't I, to leave this? Oh, my life. Oh, no, please don't. You're going to clock all the equipment. Uh, do you know something? We are going to manually... Oh, We're going to do this little bit ourselves, because that is ridiculous. Yeah. Then we shall start it at nearest, which I think it was by the gate, if I remember right. In fact, let's stop thinking, and let's actually look. It is... switch that just around here but we want it on just past that turn off or it might go up that right okay that here none and nearest go right smash it we've got plenty of trailers let's get number two going If we can get one of the baler, we might actually get that, because obviously not the ba yeah, no, the baler, because it windrow bales, doesn't it? So we might at least get that going, it just seems sensible to me, not to leave everything, yeah, to be doing the two things, I think that's not a bad idea. Yeah, I, I do agree though, it is, if we were staying, it definitely would be wanting to try to arrange the way that we've got double gates, in a way, yeah that we don't get caught out with this type of manoeuvre all the time. Although I suppose, yeah, no, because we'd do it with the bail trailer, wouldn't we, normally? Let's see. Is that dropped? Is that... No, hey, that's okay. It's always the angle, I think, that you look at. Now let's go to the right side. Uh, why? Oh, because he... No, he's left. He should be doing the outer edge. Activate and right. But we can learn from our experience before. Go on that first bit. Right, 
so Baylor. Cormick, which is, I think, in that very field, if I remember rightly. Wow, Mr. Smith, you have actually remembered something correctly for once. Oh, wow, that actually does just about go under there. Bail pusher. Don't forget the bail pusher. I can't remember. Does it destroy the entire bail or does it finish this off? Under FS22, it's a different set of rules than it was. In fact, we might as well do this field. Okay then, 10.3 metres on this field, which is fields, can I remember from last time, 68 is my guess, yes, fantastic, 68, 10.3, clear load, activate, and first, Go. Right, smashing. It's you going. At least if we get the bales going, it's, that is very useful. Right, why are you not self unloading? You didn't didn't do a thing. Oh, seriously. Get yourself gone. Can we get to that? Let's have a look. No. Yes. Obi Wan. Gordon Bennett. Right, okay. Talk about. Wow. I've got crop destruction on. That should I surely should have got that. Surely. Crop destruction is on. Oh, I must roll. Yeah, I'm, I'll roll with it then. I thought I'd just caught that really, but it's definitely on. Did I uh, now you all saw me start that past that first line, so why did it immediately veer down the wrong line when we gone past it? Do you know, seriously. Right, okay, well at least we know. Shall we time-lapse this? Do you know, I think that's not a bad idea because we're going to do this field, that field. We're going to do as much bailing as possible. When I'm not aiming to do all of the bailing today, but yeah, if we can get a couple of the fields done, that'd be fantastic. So, I am going to say my words. I'm going to see you guys and gals on the other side.
few, right, a few, yeah, quite a few strange occurrences. The I couldn't detach the front <laughs> bucket, and I was definitely on the ground. That was not my driving. It was because it was such a horrible. I mean, <laughs> not late saying, but yeah, there's such a hill. It was turning this. It's not the most powerful tractor, so yeah, the torpedo was pushing on the middle. So, yeah, I, I don't mind taking the rap for something that was mine. But yeah, that one is really strange. It's crashed and burned. We've had quite a few mod crashes today. Let's just see if it'll let me let it go now. But it wouldn't let me detach even when it was on the trailer. I thought, well, let's be clever. Let's put that on the trailer. Yeah. Now, I've never known that before. We're literally perfectly flat. And it's not like... Yeah. Yeah, I don't know what that's about. It's just crashed and burned, so it's rather a shame. We're going to have to get out of the game and go get that next time, um, which means I'm going to do... Yeah, that's... I know, while we're here, let's just do another water load at least. Yeah. Let's feel smashing. So we're going at the two harvesters. That's the last job I am going to do. We're going to do all the other side jobs. We fed them. Uh, was there enough? I don't think there was. No. We are going to do that. No way I'm leaving animals not fed. Manure, slurry, all that type of stuff. I'm going to do that next session with the grass. I'm not speeding time up. We'll just... In fact, I'm, yeah, it's, I said August. But, you know, I think I'm going to do it now. I'm going to cut the grass. We're not going to rush time on. There's no need. Really no point in doing that, so... But I'm well chuffed. We've done two of the... Yeah, the two barley fields from yesterday, we've baled those. So that's two... Yeah. So we'll get on with the baling. I'm trying to think about how much work there is still to do. Right, let's get this right while we're concentrating. We'll look at the wheat. Hopefully, in fact, you know, I'm going to do it now. Because I know what I'm like. I'm only going to forget, like I did yesterday... Oh, 101 tons, 650. Well, I didn't think we'd done so well, but I, I have a sneaky feeling. Didn't we have a little bit of wheat before? I should check in editing, but I think we did. I didn't, because I think the... I don't know, actually. Ah, yeah, it was a lot from the other one. TMR. Concentrate, Mr. Smith. Let's not yeah, get sidetracked. While that's filling, we are going to go and do the water. Ah, that's, no, we've done the water. That's good. We did that yesterday. We shall do this water. Right, smash it. Yeah, I'll obviously, I'm going to do the manure and the slurry next session. They're going to be the little side jobs when we set the mowers going and things like that. Milk. Ooh, that's a point. Milk. It has been a monster, if I'm honest. I think we've done quite well. We've done all of the harvest. That's one of the biggest jobs we've got to do. And also somehow managed to pull in the baling as well for two feet. So I don't, don't seriously think that's terrible, really. All things considered. We will go and get the harvesters, though. I'm not leaving those over there. I was sort of thinking about, well, you don't need the harvest anymore, and I thought, don't be ridiculous, I want to finish this exact, play this exactly as I would, as if we were doing any work, yeah, we'll have to fetch that next session, when the mod crash, clash has, right, let's grab, let's grab that as well, actually, well, no, because we're going to need it to do the two fields over here, so, do you know something, right, let's... you pop then? I never saw... Yes, you did. Smash it. Now, these don't seem to follow each other very well. Yeah. Got everything, though. Just got the baling to do in the two fields from today. So that's not bad. I'm quite pleased with that. Obviously, yeah, I'm going to cut the grass. Next session. Is it following me? Yes. Oh, it was very slow, the any harvester. I was quite pleased with the uh, John Deere's self unload because that used that I must remember the 550 because there's a lot of John Deere's of the additional sort of terrible at self unload as I proved on Rombos when we went through almost all the John Deere's including the Giants one that did not self unload very well at all. It's very hit and miss whereas that yesterday with Padme was an absolute do you see what I mean? 
this is relaxing. Yeah, let's just drive one at a time because it is truly rubbish. Follow me is really not worth doing with harvesters as it stands at present. I'm not saying it never is, but. Yeah. Seriously, I went over there, did I like that? That's you following me. I, I went over there. I don't somehow think I did. You absolute wally. Uh, oh. You know. I love the way that you get the reflections off the solar panels. That's amazing. I've noticed it two or three times this session. Quite amazing. The, the glow and the, the beacon lights. It is. I do love this level of realism, the shining lights that reflect off things. It is quite an amazing feat that giants have done right. If we reverse in, we would then be on the left hand side. We can actually go tight against the side of that wall. And when I say tight, I don't mean scrunching the paint, Mr. Smith. Yes, pay attention. It's not bad. Pipe, remember the pipe. Oh no, it's actually took nicely. That's about right. Right, let's grab you then. Yeah. Wow, do you know I reckon we might just do that. Remember we need to get the Yeah, the pa tiger. We just want to say panther. I know there is a panther, but not that. That's the tiger. No, that, that, no, that's just scrunching. Now that's what we don't want you to do. Get the John D and stick that in as well. Wow, I'm well impressed with that. Let's see, it's with a, good, a bit of good parking. Right, we're going to need to leave the trailer, the header trailer. Yeah, I, did you like my header trailer? I'm going to remember that one. That was amazing. It is. I mean, I know it was about the right height, but if you're clever or lucky, <laughs> you drop them just over the edge. Now, the, the real trick will be to see if you can grab them off it, because that was what, what threw his last time. Yeah, you, you could put them on, but... Right, how are we going to drop? We'll do this with a... Yeah. Protractor, I think. I suppose we could sort of so we'll do that yeah that's not bad careful not to yeah let's see ooh that's a bra yeah so yes uh, 538 litres Mr Smith you were 500 litres I did know that's why I did it at ooh did that just no it didn't yeah, I did think um, when I saw it, I thought there's way too much on those corners because we redid the field edge and I did it a little generously so we didn't hit anything a little too generously. So, yes, glad we went over that. Right, we'll stick this away and then next session we'll get on with all of the other jobs. We've, yeah, waters, the, the fed watered. Um, yeah, we're gonna. F I, ha I know I'm double handling, but I wanted to show you how well we've done, and I wanted it to be accurate without it starting to eat away to make flour and things from it. So next session we'll also be sticking that in there. Or in fact, you know, that's something I am gonna do. We will grab the 70 tonner, and I think we're gonna grab. Yeah, even though it's gonna take another five minutes or so. I seriously think. Yeah, we we need both. One of each, that's what we'll do. We'll do 70 tons of barley and 70 tons of wheat. And then we are going to leave it there. Pick the bales up tomorrow, next session. Yeah, actually, it may well be tomorrow because I am trying my absolute utmost to. Yeah, I'd like to. I don't, and I don't mean this in a way of get them out of the way. I really would like to concentrate on Hobos Hollow and Greenlands to completion. And not because I want to get rid of them, but I just, it is its completion. Also, so we can move on with the next chapter, the farms that we're going to do. I am completely aware that I haven't done any, uh, no, it's not straw, none of that. Oh, 
God, you know, every single time I can always choose the wrong one. On my um, Attingham, I haven't forgotten it. Uh, and also the... Um, oh, do, I did, do you know earlier I remembered the, the name of the farm where I've got sheep. And ne right now I'm talking to you again. I've totally forgotten. Oh, come on. It's not revisited. It's Thornton revamped. That's it. Gordon Bennett. Yeah, Thornton. I haven't forgotten about either of those. I'd like... They are my replacements. One is... Yeah, the Thornton is going to be my ultra-realistic. It is. I'm going to have a bit of a practice on the manual. I did have trouble with one of the fertiliser spreaders, and it wasn't... It was making the right noises where you hold it down. One you're supposed to click and what you're supposed to hold down. Well, I was doing both, and it was not doing what it should have done, so, yeah, it really wasn't me. I don't mind taking the blame, and it, it, it's easily, it could easily be me, but it wasn't. So, again, we've seen mod clashes even today, so it could just be something silly like that. You've got to come out of the game and then go back in, so... It's tight. So, we've got half a load of each once I've done this. Yeah, I'd also you will have seen me cr crash into... Again, it's the weight was pushing me. Okay, my fault. I didn't allow for it. I'm not denying it was my fault, but it wasn't as simple as bad steering. It was steering under way too much weight. Yeah, you, you forget your braking is completely different. It does push you, a, a, a push you around a lot. And I just... I did just crashed into the back end of this. She got a super duper steerer, so you've got no excuse. No, this is true. I totally take that. Yeah, it might you can say that, and then it pushes you around like that, so it's not quite as cool dry as you think. Right. While we're here, let's have a look doing in this beast so I would imagine well we've got two millions to finish so it's going to be draining straight away and I would imagine we're probably over a mil in this now Water. oh oh no so where's that going then because we've done two or three of these I do think we will, uh, as a point, I'm not sure, obviously the um, the land baccarai, the bakery, that has been nobbled, but it is still the best of all the bakeries, it is still very good, just not as good as it was previously, but I think it's still 28 tonnes per day of bread that it uh, literally sells, and that is a lot, so... Yeah, I'm not sure whether we... It's going to be enough, though. Or whether we actually... I'm going to need to... Uh, I might need to do a little bit off-camera of sums. Right, barley. To see if... Because I... Oh, the trouble is we haven't got much room. I think it'll be just another one of those things that we'll do the absolute best that we can with the equipment that we've got. Because the other thing is, obviously, realistically... It's all right on a uh, let's play where you've got, but all of our fields, these grass fields, we cut. We can't really afford to be losing that or putting another bakery, and there's no room on that for another bakery. So there is an element of space in any proper place. You, if you cannot build physically a place, then you can't do it. So it is what it is. trying to be as realistic as possible and that really is part of the realism too that you can only afford we would need to buy all the land and I'm not doing that now that is just yeah it's going to play around with the profit margin so you're not really gaining anything if I buy another field to put something on it I'm only offsetting the costs I'm not really doing anything positive so yeah we'll stick with what we've got yeah there's no room for another one really because it would play around with where we do the water. Right, last job then. Yeah, this has been quite a monster session, but thoroughly enjoyed this. We have done a lot of work, and I know I've already said that, I'm repeating myself. Right.
minutes. Last one of the day. Yes, yeah, so just one last check on the animals. Wow, oh my life. 123 tons of slurry. We need some more straw. 53 tons of milk. 23 tons of that. And, oh my life, 81 tons. Let's have a quick look at the animals. I would imagine they're all mature now. Oh no, they're still pub pubescent. They're not. They're fully grown. They're pubescent. They're not. They're fully grown. And they're pubescent. So actually, still quite a lot so that are quite far into puberty, though. So our milk is going to go through the roof at some point, maybe, for the next farmer that buys the farm. Yeah. Wow, that is amazing. It really is. Right. So that is where I'm going to leave it. Just under two meals still, because obviously it's still the same day, but we've We've, yeah, we've loaded that silage. We're going to got all of that slurry, which obviously it can only take 70 or 75 tons a day. So there's, yeah, I might actually start to have to sell some at the slurry yard. You don't get a lot for it, it's, which is rather strange when you consider that the slurry yard is called the slurry yard. Yeah, it's not a terribly good price for that. But yeah, you can see 75 tons of slurry, 75 tons of manure. So we can sell, I believe we can sell both on this. I'm sure you can. Let's have a quick look. I never, don't think I've ever, oh I have, I have sold. But not in FS22, I have in FS19. So let's have a look, manure. Yes, slurry yard. Oh wow, not a bad price either. Yeah, when I say not, I'm saying versus digestate. Yeah, digestate is twice as <laughs> twice as good as slurry and manure, but it's still not a bad price. It's just that obviously super duper prices are for digestate. Right, so yeah, I st obviously I I say we're close. We've done all of the. We've got to feed our animals through every month. We've got one last bit of work, which is the cutting. The last cut we're gonna do this year gonna do that or are we gonna because I was gonna do August if we did July August September October I am only doing the one court I, I seriously think what I might do is grab the bales next session and bale the because we've still got quite a lot of straw work to do I think we're gonna grab those stick those in speed the month up and put the um, silage in do all the little jobs and I think we will go through to August and then we will do the moan as we originally planned yeah I do, truly do think so I don't want to rush rush everything so yeah I mean we've not got the we would normally well, in September we'd be re-sowing, and then of course the big, all the big job we've got to do is our harvest with our own. Yes, our own sugar beet harvester. I'm looking forward to that. I am. That is one of the last jobs we'll do, and then of course we've got our normal get rid of the um, digestate. I know equally, obviously, each month we're going to be selling the milk and doing the, the energy work. So I, uh, I'm seriously thinking still quite a lot of work to do here that's why it may not happen I, I I plan now on working this to the end but it, there's sometimes far more work than you think so it might be probably better for patience working through this over the next few weeks it's just I didn't want yeah the um, Attingham Park to be not done for a long time because there is a lot of work to get any kind of traction on this rhombos and um, yeah, and I don't want to drop anything. I don't. I'm not going to do that. It's a long-term commitment. So that's why I thought it wouldn't be a bad idea to try to concentrate on this and um, Hobo's Hollow, so that that's the two completed. It's drawing a line in the sand, and then we've got the two Atting the Attingham and my sheep farm that I've forgotten. Thornton revamped. Yeah, there's those two, and Rombos and Stone Valley. Yeah, that's, and that would be. I don't want to be taken. I don't want to ever put myself in the position where I've got seven Let's Plays again. It is. It was a very silly thing for me to do. It truly was, and I don't want to do that again. It's. It's silly. I don't think it's fair on you, the viewers, because 
it sometimes takes a long time to get around all seven or you can't do them justice or you forget too much you get too rusty I always say that about and it is true you're juggling and you're not always remembering things if you've only got three or four it's not quite so difficult and I know most content creators will only ever take two on max I know that is a quite a common number I like the variety if I'm honest I think it's it helps to keep things fresh but there is also the element where you as a content creator are a bit rusty and you can't quite remember what equipment you've got or quite remember what days but then there's always I can always stand around and have a look and poke around for two minutes before I start the camera so I, I, I try to do that now a little bit just to sort of remind myself have a look at the fields that type of things on the map before I start the camera so that I've caught up with where we are and all the rest of it so it's not yeah, it's not rocket science. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, and I'm going to say goodbye for now.